Welcome back to Timberborn. Our beavers are busily building water storage, although not really pumping enough water storage, water to store water. But we're back and uh, everything looks okay. We've almost got 200 water. The water's going up, technically. Um, so we can't, you can't want anything more than that. I kind of want haulers. Uh, so that the water people don't have to keep hauling the water so far. It is actually kind of far. This guy has the, the closest run, and um, the rest of them are just just miles away. And it's not not a benefit. However, look at this. We can now make planks. Um, and considering how many logs we have, I'm kind of not opposed to it. Also, do we move the fermenters? Well, we're not going to have any power now, so let's not. But we might end up pumping this dry, and I think that's okay. Um, because, okay, we need, we need to get a couple of, um, let's go down to two builders. Go, oh, we can't do this. Right, because we have no power. And I don't know if it's worth putting in a power wheel during the off times. Yeah, it is. Let's get this up. We'll do this for now. And then turn it off during the, the wet seasons. This is a huge drought. Ten day drought. I don't know that we have enough water for this. But... I do want to make sure that these workplaces are always at the tipping top here. Okay. Um, yeah, I think everything is actually going to be fine. Oh, this little tree in our way. I couldn't put a path down. Uh, what do we want up here? I don't know, but you can't get there anyway. Probably... Kohlrabi's. We don't have a food issue yet, but we are definitely going to if we keep having to do these droughts. Half tempted to fast forward again like we did last time, but we missed the building of the of the dam and somehow they got more wood. I don't even know. I need to watch that video. <laughs> Rewatch it, I should say. Maybe I will. All right. Awesome. We don't have enough water to sustain us for nine days unless... Oh, wait. You know what I want to do also? We're going to do it... Uh... Does this ha constantly have to have two water in it always? And does the water go down while the breeding process is happen happening? Those are my questions. And I, I don't know how to know. Well, you know, the... We built the dam over here too, by the way, so we actually have water down here. As a matter of fact, might want to pause. Let's pause another pump. We may want to pump this water out, actually. Instead of this water. Because our food is up here, and the only thing down here is a little bit of food and trees. But I'm going to leave it alone for now anyway. We're at our storage max, so there is very little reason to adjust things it would be good to get this stuff built uh, over here wait why oh we're waiting on this okay we're just waiting on one more plank which we have so we're waiting on to tomorrow this will this storage will be in service which is great and then hopefully eventually we'll get up there that's going to be good they'll build this thing here. That'll be good. Perfect. Now I think we really do want to get a um, a hauling post. And now remember, the hauling post can be anywhere. They don't go to it every day to to get the things. So, I'm going to shove it like back in this corner. In fact, that's where I am going to shove it. Like that. 
and but we're going to build in the order that we have things going for now. Uh, with the exception of, uh, well, we'll let that, no, no, I don't, we don't, well, whatever, <laughs> we'll let it go, but I don't need people working in it. We don't need the gears yet. Confusing myself. It might be pretty good here with the, the way that things are going. I just took a, a sip of coffee and reminded me to thank the members for being here. If you haven't liked the video, please consider it. Consider subscribing, uh, the like button, etc. Those are things that Mr. Beast would tell me I need to say. So, I have said it. But yes, the members have generously bought me coffee over the past couple months, and uh, thank you. Oh, yeah. I would say each membership is one cup or maybe three recordings. Okay, let's pause that. Do we need to unpause this? And if we do that, are we going to die? Oh, we definitely need to unpause this. I don't think we, we definitely don't have enough water to sustain all these people. And when I wanna pause this, because that's done, this is going to be done very soon, so we'll pause that. And this one's going to be done even sooner, so we'll wait for it to be done, and then we'll pause it so that we're not using the two two water. Um, any second now. Pause. This one. We have five babies, and two people need jobs, so this is fine. I just saw something out of the corner of my eye that I thought was a spider but I think it was a reflection on my glasses because I don't have my contacts in. So, scary stuff. Very scary. But it turned out actually nothing to worry about. I heard someone say that 90% of your worries never come true. So, there you go. For whatever that's worth. Excuse me, I had a sneeze. Okay. Everything is looking just spectacular. I do want to pause that. We're not doing that right now. We are running out of logs. This guy, we get the rest of these, so I'm going to let him. And then we can figure out what we're going to do over here. It's going to be industrial, probably, even though it's green. Uh, but we can move the industry once we have engines, but we can't get engines without metal, and we can't get metal yet. Uh, I do want to get rid of the berries, just the berries, not the trees. There we go. Uh, because we are going to be getting this metal, but I will get the wood first. No, we didn't need that. Okay. In fact, we'll go ahead and start the process of chopping these trees. Because I don't want them in my way. And we're going... Oh, we're almost to, we're almost to metal. Perfect. Four days left of the drought. Um, I think we're going to be fine. I really do. do we, have, we don't have anybody that is needing work yet so we're waiting patiently oh we don't need this full by the way this can go down to as many as we need but not full and then let's open up one of these so now we know that the seven beavers that we need are always going to be haulers up here where it says vacancies as long as that is 10 or le um, le 10 or less we know they're haulers Okay, perfect. They're getting the trees. Everybody's happy. Actually, they're not real happy. But, um, get another house in here. We were gonna do, unlock these houses here. Because it's eight inhabitants, which is just two less, but that fits in a smaller spot. We just need 600 science for that. But I think it's a good idea because this is a map that we are 
hoping to have space. We have three days left and no water. Technically, we have no food either. Although all this is unfermented cassava, so we could actually build another storage area and get more cassavas fermenting. I don't think that's a bad idea, to be honest. Maybe, maybe we'll have the wood for this. Uh, we can put stairs there. Um, why do we do it this way again? We put stairs there, we can't go up. Nah. Nah, we won't do that. But we will come to here. Put a path. This is going to be... Fermented cassavas. Perfect. Down to 45 water. And um, we have 13 planks, so let's pause like this and this. Now we have haulers. I can't see anything going wrong with this. Uh, I don't know what I want to put in here yet. Um, more berries? I mean, there's no harm in that, really. It's a long walk for the berries. And we just, we'll just leave it alone for now. I don't know. I don't know what I want in there. It won't be metal, I'll tell you that much. But, speaking of not being metal, we can begin our metal journey here. Let's begin our metal journey. Yes, I know that just was detrimental to the cause because we were going to have those buildings. Um, but we can always unlock more science if we need it. All right, last day of the drought and everybody should be fine because we have no water, yes, but um, that's okay. But we do need to make sure that the farms are ready. We need to make sure that by the time the drought is done, we'll be pumping water. And we got metal, metal scrap coming in, which is excellent. Very cool. Can't get any better than this, really. And we can't put metal scrap in here, correct? Correct. That's okay. Soon we're going to have engines. What we need to do is plant more trees over here. So I think if we came here, we could plant trees. This guy's work is done. And actually, we're going to move them, so we may as well also want to get... We're just going to get rid of this tree. Actually, I'm going to get rid of all of this. Um, didn't realize that was going to happen, but that's okay. Let us get water immediately. That will open up soon. We probably need to pump more water. And we also need to get start getting gears so that we can start winning in that area. We're going to need planks and we're going to need gears. Um, how many un-68 cassavas? Okay, perfect. The cassavas are saving us. There are people, beavers, that need water. But we are powering at 100 and nothing. Just a little bit of um, back and forth here. 100, 250 ish, maybe. Let's see. It's going to be a little bit of bouncing. Okay, don't, don't panic, my boys and girls. We're going to be fine. Go ahead and grab water as it comes in. It's going up slowly. It's all coming together nicely. Going to need a forester here, and then of course a flag here. 
like that. Whenever they get around to it, you know? I don't want them to feel rushed. But look at this. We are at 185 of the 200 that we need. So, yes, the next step is going to be getting engine power. And we're going to move the industry up top, like I said, because we don't want to be in the green area. That's where we're going to need food and such. We don't need a whole lot more beavers, but we do need some beavers. Oh, no, the drought's coming. Okay, pause. Oh, man. That's... That's bad. That's not good. Why did the music stop when this happened? Can I get a road through here? Oh. Well... Um, this is, uh, not ideal. At all. But, let's get a path here. These are bad, bad things happened happening. We will not survive a drought at this rate if we don't get this stuff done super fast. What? Oh. So we don't need this. We don't need this. Okay. We need to pump very, very quickly. Like, very, very quickly. Workplace. High priority. Yeah, this guy's got nothing to do. But, uh, turns out that's not even an issue right now. And what else? Oh, yeah, let's do this. Uh, very fast. We have 200 logs, so this should not be an issue. And we have a bunch of haulers. No, we don't. We have zero haulers. Okay. Um, well, okay, we pause this. And we have plenty of planks for now. Let's pause that. That gives us some, some haulers, right? No, we're still at zero, I believe. Yeah. Oh, what are we doing? This all is going to be water. Water. Quickly. Quickly, give me water. Or give, or give us all death. That's how this is going to work. Fermented cassavas. Okay. We need to pump all the water before the drought starts. I mean, obviously. Let's, let's um, run 24-hour shifts until the drought starts. And then we'll go back down. All this is going to be oak eventually. So he can go ahead and start that. Don't mind. Okay. Please pump fastly and quickly. I actually could unlock, I think, this medium tank. She's gonna replace these up here, but I am not. We'll put it here, maybe. This looks like a good place. As good a place as any. It takes 20 gears, of which we have 10, so. Not happening. Look, we filled up the water, though. So we will go back down to the 16 hour days now. Is that what it was originally? Yeah. And then, um, it's unfortunate, but we're going to pause these th three and leave those two running and slowly deplete the water. I don't think we have enough. We're also going to pause the ble breeding because we don't need more baby beavers yet. And we are good to go. Yeah, probably fine. Everything's probably fine. We're gonna find out real soon. We're gonna mess around and find out. That's what the uh, that's what the old saying said. So to get an engine, 
we need 25 gears, 20 logs, and 20 metal. So we have to start with the metal. I forgot about that. So we're going to need to unlock the smelter, which is going to require science. I still would love to get houses, which now I put a tank where the houses were going to go. But we can change that. In the meantime, we're going to have to come back and see if we survive a seven-day drought. Easy. We survived the 10 with no problem, technically, right? Let's pause that. Uh, we'll be back. Before you know it, I hope you have a great rest of your day.